Hi, this is Crystal with Catching Up with Crystal. I am outside of the Emanuel Protestant Episcopal Church, founded in 1689, erected in 1703. I am going to take a tour with you, or you with me, on a tour of the cemetery. So, there's some pretty cool stuff in here, some pretty cool graves. This says, in memory of Martha Jane, daughter of Leonard and Susan Hemel, Hemley, who, de who departed this life September 24th, 1827, aged two years, four months, and 22 days. Elizabeth Smith died August 12th, 1827, age 43. Captain George Israel, Captain George L. Israel died February 20th, age 31. I can't make out the year, 1823 he died. Captain George L. Israel died February 20th, age 31. In memory of Margaret Israel, daughter of Samuel so that that is Samuel over there and Elizabeth and Elizabeth is also over there so her parent parents are there of Philadelphia who departed this life the 12th day of August 1795 at 16 months in memory of Lydia Israel who departed this life September 4th, 1799, age five months. It seems like these these kids aren't living long. These The Israel children, they lost a lot of children at a young age. Here lies Rebecca, the daughter of Joseph and Susanna Israel, who departed this life 3 September 1887, age 16 months. In memory of Mary Ross, who departed this life April 30th, 1734, age 24 years old. These are like some pretty old graves. can't even read some of these. John Janiver, J-A-N-V-I-E-R. Oh, I can't even read it. 56 years of age. The fall hope of a blessed immortal immortality. I can't read it. I don't know how old this is, but it's a it's a it's a family vault. There's something that says an infant son here. I'm not sure what the oldest one is. Hugh Wright or Richie. Hugh Richie, born October 1775, died. May 4th, 18, I can't make out the year. Esther, his wife, born August 26, 1785, died November 6, 1886. Anna was born in 1816, died October 2nd. She was, oh, she only, she was three years old, died in 1819. This is like a family crypt. There's a bunch of people here. The Richie crypt. I hope I'm not being disrespectful. Mary Eve is born 
February. No, she was born November 19th, 1724. She died January the 4th, 1768. Here is a name I haven't heard before. This is an oldie. It might be Uramus. E. E. B. R. E. B. A. S. M. U. S. Jackson, a native of Ireland who departed this life March 18th, 1800, age 33 years. He was beloved in life, and I and something in death he lieth the body here lieth the body of elizabeth wife of eramus or eramus jackson daughter of james and jane mccullough who departed this life july 15th 1818 in the 42 years of her age and at her request was interred in the same grave with her husband Oh, so there they share one grave. I mean, some of these are just too old to read. This is a recent burial. This lady was born, was buried in. Uh, These are old. I mean, they're just so old you can't make out some of the writing, but they're, it's kind of cool. John C. Corden, born December 20th, 1881, died December 24th, 1903. George Hewlett, May 15th, 1836, Died March 6, 19. Ooh, a rabbit. Look at that. It scared me. I didn't know what that was running. These cool, though, cool old crypts. Oh, Barbara King. I have a friend whose mom's name is Barbara King. Died August 9th, 1879, in her 73rd years of her age. No night of sorrow, none of pain. Bid perfect and redeemed and saved. She sweetly sleeps until her Savior's breath. in Jesus that one doesn't have I wonder if that's a baby how you doing it is. Look at these old they're just so old. In memory of Anne Jane I can't make out Stone daughter of Guy and Dorothea Stone who departed this life August 17th 1801 aged one year nine months and three days. Sarah Blount, born 1850. March 8, March 7th, 1850, died. I can't make it out. Some of them are just so aged that you can't really 
Here's John Yates, born. John Yates was born April 30th, 1793, died June 30th, 1849. Henry, I can't make that one out either. Some of them are just the it's so worn you can't but they're some of them are like the they're kinda cool. Look at how the architecture in here. Okay, I'm leaving. This is Rebecca, daughter of the late Banks and Taylor of Philadelphia and wife of Chauncey P. Holcomb, departed this life November 3rd, 1851, age 33 years. Clara, she died a February 9th, 9, 1846, age 4 months and 20 days. Chauncey Pettibone died April 30th. April 10th, 1850, age 14 months and 27 days. Lots of history. Lots of history. Had me a Karen walk through here trying to see what I was up to. Anyway, this is Crystal with Catching Up with Crystal. And um, please like and subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell notification so that you know when new content is posted. If you like more, like to see more content like this, please let me know. I'd be happy. I'd be happy to um, get it for you.